Russia warns West, we can target your commercial satellites. Here's a summary of the article. A senior Russian foreign ministry official said that commercial satellites from the United States and its allies could become legitimate targets for Russia if they were involved in the war in Ukraine. Russia, which in 1957 launched Sputnik 1, the first man-made satellite, into space and in 1961 put the first man in outer space, has a significant offensive space capability, as do the United States and China. In 2021, Russia launched an anti-satellite missile to destroy one of its own satellites. Konstantin Vorontsov, deputy director of the Russian Foreign Ministry's Department for Non-Proliferation and Arms Control, told the United Nations that the United States and its allies were trying to use space to enforce Western dominance. Russia against the use of satellites to aid Ukraine. Vorontsov, reading from notes, said the use of Western satellites to aid the Ukrainian war effort was an extremely dangerous trend. Quasi-civilian infrastructure may be a legitimate target for a retaliatory strike, Vorontsov told the United Nations First Committee, adding that the West's use of such satellites to support Ukraine was provocative. This post received a score of 35,000, with an upvote ratio of 91%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. We won't, because then you'd tear our asshole apart, but we can do it. At this point I'm wondering if Putin is getting off on the idea of getting fucked hard. That Russian Putasi got us acting unwise. Please never say the phrase, Russian Putasi, ever again. Thank you. Russian P-U-T-U-S-S-Y. A very Russian response. You and what army? That's become a legitimate question. Remember when they used to display those? Super soldier? Suits? Wonder where those all went? Sold for vodka and food. Every day a new warning. Russia is so creative in it. Next day, Russia warns it has a large warning book. And warns that if less than request greater than is not done, then they give all warnings from the warning book. Evil Dictations for Dummies Volume 2. We can take Kiev in two days. The biggest flex is the US can fire a sword missile at you. You mean this thing? Why TF would you even need the blades? If a missile that size hits you at that speed I don't think the blades will make much difference lol. I had that same exact thought. I guess the blades just ensure a slightly larger kill zone. Just in case it is off a few feet in its targeting. Hello I work in ammo for the USAF and yes you are correct. A Hellfire R9X can be accurate within one inch of a designated target. But the effective target range is up to one meter. Since this missile doesn't explode, those wings will absolutely shred anything next to it. Here is a link that shows the missile only hitting the car. And here, we see why it needs the blades. It landed in the middle of the windshield. Depending on the direction it flew in, it might have just crashed through the windshield, through the gear shifter, and hit the floor. Scary as fuck, probably cause a car accident, maybe bruise your arm and thigh with flying plastic parts, but not 100% guaranteed to kill you. The blades pop out the sides and one of them will at least penetrate the right half of your body, if driving. Yup. And as fucked as it is, the missile simply hitting the car wouldn't guarantee a kill. Certainly grievous injuries, but not a guaranteed death. A blade chopping that whole car into taco cheese? Nah. They seem to struggle for accuracy against earthly targets. Can't imagine they'd be too accurate in targeting space objects. TBF though, they just said? Target? Not? Hit? The trick is they'll target the military ones to ensure they hit the civilian ones. Shoot for the moon so if you miss you may ding a Starlink. Or hit Germany. H-M-Y-S-A-R-T-I-C-L-E-5-T-I-M-E. You have graduated to North Korea? This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.